Hey guys, it's Matt coming to you from the Mr. Pompadour Barber Lounge. And today we're gonna to talk to you guys about the five differences between the Moroccan texture paste and the natural beeswax paste. So the first difference is consistency. The Moroccan texture paste is fibrous and stringy and it's easier to scoop out of the jar. Well, the natural beeswax paste is thicker and waxy and it takes a little bit of muscle to scoop it out of the jar. The second difference is holding strength. Moroccan texture paste is easier to scoop out of the jar, so it provides more of a medium hold. Where the natural beeswax paste, because it has wax in it, provides more of a high, flexible hold. Now onto the third difference, the amount of shine. Moroccan texture paste has coconut oil in it and Moroccan argan oil in it, so it provides just a touch of shine, where natural beeswax paste just provides a true, natural matte finish. The fourth difference is ease of application. Moroccan texture paste is smooth and creamy, so it's easy to apply to the hair while well, you need to warm up the natural beeswax paste in your palm before applying it to the hair. The fifth and final difference is the ability to restyle. Moroccan texture paste is medium hold, so you won't be able to restyle it as many times throughout the day. While natural beeswax paste has a higher flexible hold, and you'll be able to restyle it as many times throughout the day as you want. All right, I appreciate you guys sticking around to, to learn about the top five differences between the Moroccan texture paste and the natural beeswax paste. If you have any other questions, shoot us an email or find us on Instagram at mr.pompadour.